Hey, Courtney Thomas here. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Um, so what I have for you today is a question. And that is, what is your biggest regret in life so far? <laughs> uh, this is one that I love. It can lead to some really cool and deep and interesting conversation. If you happen to bring this up uh, in conversation among friends or whatever, um, it's something that I think about often because I do a uh, typically like so once a semester um, <clears throat> thing as an alumni with the college that I went to that's a project with students where they have an assignment where they interview an alum and uh, ask a series of questions and like write a report on it. Um, and it's through the business school, as I've mentioned before, like I'm super into career stuff. So like anything that I can do, especially as kind of a non-traditional uh, entrepreneur business owner, uh, I like to give them a different perspective. But anyway, one of the questions that's always on this same list of questions, and I've done this project like three or four times now with different students is uh, what do, their context is what do you like what's your biggest regret in college um, like what did you miss out on that kind of a thing and that question is so easy for me because not only is it my biggest regret of college but is my biggest regret of my life and that is not studying abroad and believe me like I have done some stuff in my life <laughs> like some stuff uh, and that still like always takes the cake. Like I don't have a whole ton of guilt or shame or any other stuff around any of that stuff. I like, there are some big things again that have happened in my life, but I would not call them regrets. I've called them experiences and lessons that I've learned from, but that is one that I'm like, God, that, that was dumb. Like I kind of can't get over it. You know, it was really interesting too. Again, this was like, um, a conversation that came up recently among a group of friends and I was so surprised because it was something that uh, those people also experienced and said that they would name as one of their biggest regrets was not studying abroad in college because we had like this fantastic opportunity to do so right and if you think about it really a lot of colleges and you know certainly some percentage of college kids in general like have a little bit more opportunity at that time in life, a little more freedom to be able to do that kind of travel, right? Before you've got a job, before it's like, oh, let me plan the two weeks of vacation before you're paying as much money for like your rent and your living and like all of the things, right? Usually there's scholarships available, all that kind of stuff. And it was funny because among this group of friends, only one of them did study abroad. And um, she was like, first of all, she was like, Honestly, I almost didn't because my parents kind of discouraged it and I had a professor who really pushed me like a few times and finally I was like, okay, like I'm really freaked out to do this, but I'm going to do it anyway. And it essentially like changed the course of her life, which is how I always look at like, what if I did that? Like, there's so many different things about it that I always feel like, God, I missed out. Like, not only like would I not to this day in my mid thirties be so freaked out and like nervous and feel like I totally don't know anything about anything and how to do anything when it comes to international travel. I'm sure I would have had a much, much higher comfort level had I done that and experienced it earlier in my life when I wasn't so like, not set in my ways, but just like where you're more fearful of things, um, you know, as an older adult, um, you know, I, I'm sure I would have been far more conscious and open to different cultures uh, and experiences and ways of living other than just in the United States. There's just like so many other things that I know would have had such a different and unique effect on my life. And for that reason, again, like especially like hearing that story from my friend, it was really cool because I was like, yeah, like that's why it's my biggest regret. Like, oh, interesting. You know, that totally nails it. Um, so that's it for me. You know, I, uh, hope to remedy that, you know, basically and kind of make up for it later in life here by, uh, getting out there and traveling internationally and doing, you know, different and interesting and scary things and like getting uncomfortable <laughs> and like, I don't know, hopefully learning new languages. I mean, we can always learn, right? But I know that's, um, I consider it a big thing. You know, I know that there are other like pretty major things, you know, that could be regrets in life of, you know, missed opportunities or um, relationships or burned bridges and 
you know, career changes and, oh, was that a mistake? And like all kinds of different things that could happen, right? You know, I mean, marriages, divorces, kids, no kids, like all of those things, right? Could be big regrets in life. So, um, I love this conversation. I would totally love to hear your story. Like, do you have one big regret in your life? Is there something that you always look back on and you're like, gosh, I wish I had done that differently. You know, I really think about that often. And I wonder what my life would have been like if I had done this differently, made a different choice, approached it differently, um, any of that stuff. I wonder. And I definitely highly encourage you to, uh, at your next dinner party or cocktail hour, or even what about a team building event or a lunch and learn or something like that, ask your people in your life, what's your biggest regret? I hope that you will share with the people in your life. I hope you'll think about it, reflect on it. What are the lessons that you can learn? I know I have. Um, and I hope it's a question that you'll think about. So as always, let me know. Tell me your story in the comments. Or um, you can always email me, get in contact with me on my website. Um, but what is your biggest regret in life? And you know what? How can you change that for the rest of your life? Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.